Hello everybody and welcome back. Today I'll be reacting to Legends of Tomorrow season four, episode 11, titled Seance and Sensibility. So first of all, I wanna say sorry that this video is coming at you guys a little bit late this week. As you all, I'm sure are aware, Klexicon was this past weekend. I lost my voice somewhat and it was a great time. Um, video coming soon, perhaps. We'll see how much time I have to edit it. I also wanna do a quick shout out this wonderful shirt that I'm wearing, I got at Klexicon, at Beyond Klexa. Maybe you've seen some of their other shirts and other artwork and stuff like that, but they have an, a ton of awesome fandom shirts for every occasion. Avalanche, all, they have the shirts that you've seen, I'm sure, with all the ships on them, listed on them. Jess McCallan actually wore one during Klexicon this weekend, so if you wanna get one of these shirts or any others, you can do that at Beyond Klexa, and I will put their info in the description for you. So getting back to Legends, getting back to the episode, last week was, I don't like using the word filler because it makes everyone upset, but it was largely a filler episode. Um, it set up a lot of plot points that I'm sure we're gonna be dealing with in the next, you know, two episodes, this one and the next one following. I know a lot of you guys had asked me yesterday to react to the promo for 12, which I hadn't even at that point seen 11. I still haven't, obviously, because we're about to watch it. But, um, so there's some big stuff coming up. We're heading now towards the end of the season. And in last week's episode, obviously, Nate's dad died after having kind of reconciled with him um, and been like, hey, you know, we're gonna work together now. And, you know, it was all f good feelings until he, you know, did the, did the going away thing. He was killed by our demon friend, um, not Mollus, forgetting his name now because we haven't dealt with him uh, since last, you know, the second, the first half of the season, pardon. Um, but he is in Dez's body, who, as we remember, is Constantine's soulmate, love of his life. We all ship so hard. And yeah, demon killed um, Mr. Nate, Mr. Nate's father. I always get them confused, like it's either Hayward or Hayworth. I think it's Hayward, but I never say it because I'm worried that I'm wrong. But in any case, he's, he's deceased now. That's all. Last week also was very Mona heavy. Um, we know that she's now turned into a werewolf Konani thing, Hawaiian, you know, goddess of some kind. So, you know, her story's a happening also. So, I mean, this episode is gonna be pretty big as I as I'm, have been seeing. I haven't seen any spoilers, but I have in fact seen obviously the promo and, you know, Bollywood number we stand. I'm so excited to see that. I mean, any episode that focuses on Zari is like already automatically my favorite um, because she's easily, you know, one of the best characters on this show and the most interesting characters. So let's stop the jibba jabba and get into the episode. Oh yeah, straight up framed for murder. Also, please forgive the obvious bullshit happening upstairs. Maybe I shouldn't intrude. Sorry, the woman I've been changing love letters with in prison killed you back. Oh, that was why you didn't want to go. I was like, why not? We're going inside. We're going inside. Which grace? Here, let me help. What in the world? Assaulting me with this already? We do not approve. I mean, she's going through a lot. We can pretend to break up anytime we want. I don't like this at all. We should, um... We what, like, who, who does this benefit? Who cares? Sorry, but no. I can't, I can't Do the legends know that they're fake dating? Do they know? Someone's gonna let it slip. Wait, wait. Oh, when in doubt, go for the M&Ms. I hope you're not Yeah, well, you have a demon following you, so congrats on that, I guess. Oh, poor Bean. Little Beanstalk. Never uncover the mirror. Oh, 
I love how they had it covered in the first place. Like, it's a very old fashioned thing to do. <laughs> He's just so whipped. Oh my god, what does her shirt say? We love a fandom queen. Now, who wants a nice, juicy steak? Now you are a monster. Exactly. I mean, how cool is that? She's like, yes, magical creatures for the win. Are you trying to get me to shift into Wolfie? They really want you to just embrace the wild side. I think so too. We should all embrace our wild sides with Charlie. Thank you. Including Zari. It appears that you're experiencing the impact of a magical fugitive. Oh wow. Okay, they made it relevant. I love that they made the shirt relevant to the plot. Oh. Oh. I we, who like none of us want that. Show me one Nate and Zari shipper. I dare you. I dare you to try. Oh my god, Mona is such a goofball. <laughs> oh, look at my Zarly. Oh, oh, oh. I'm sorry. Charlie should be livid in this moment. Oh my god, amazing. <laughs> we love a self aware show. Also, Sarah was like, tell me more, but I'm not into it. You should go smash somebody else. So, how about Charlie? She's right there. And then you can realize that you never actually no, liked Nate. Terrible idea. Okay, I'm going. Bye. Oh my god. Bath. Is there a place called Bath? This is like a Jane Austen novel come to life. <laughs> it's literally exactly what it is. Thank you, Mona, for that astute observation. Hmm, okay. She's gonna hit that, and then she's gonna be like, No, I want Charlie. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> nice, good one, very smooth. <laughs> I love them. Oh my god. Was that a currency? <laughs> oh my god, Sarah Lance is everything in the whole world. Jane. Mm -hmm. That's Jane Austen. Wow. Sarah's like, do I want to hit that? Question mark. Even though she's in a relationship now, she you can't just go gallivanting around time, sleeping with random famous women from history anymore. I do miss that. I cannot marry you, Mr. Doherty. Is she gonna hit the bride though? <laughs> <laughs> make it gay. <laughs> Jane Austen, but make it gay. I'm here. Oh my god. Legend said gay rights. <laughs> oh my god. Legend said gay rights for everyone. They g oh my god. Wow. Massive orgy <laughs> happening right now. Bed sharing. Perhaps. Oh, the, he, she still calls him Rage. I swear to God, we love it. <laughs> oh my God. Wow. <laughs> Legends said masturbate and rebel, didn't they? So the bride and the scullery maid, that was insane. Oh man, I was gonna say hi. Bisexual princess, I swear to god. Sarah Lance gives me my bi rights for real. So if anyone would have noticed, it's 
a new magical arrival in town? It would be her. Okay. You just want to go talk to her low key. But I don't blame you. Like a handsome coachman, perhaps. Oh. Oh. Okay, Sarah. Ask him some questions. You go get a girl. Okay. This is Miss Lance and Miss Wu. Oh my god. Sarah's like desperately trying to be like, I have a girlfriend, I have a girlfriend, I have a girlfriend. In town. I hate this outfit. <laughs> she looks infantile. We are so sorry. Sarah's like, we're just gonna walk around this room right now. So, the bride, Miss Sinclair. Miss Sinclair will be cut off from her fortune. The two women will have nothing to live on. But it's because of you. I mean, love will find a way to overcome any obstacle. Thank you, Mona. Mona said gay rights. Okay. Lying or you're a fool. For you shouldn't have to learn a lesson twice. Damn, bitch. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Take it in. We should be going. <laughs> Please excuse us for a moment. The the music that plays though. Is he the he's probably he's the he's the anachronism though, because he's very like He's the Bollywood star, right? Me. At any party. Um, hello demon, no one invited you to this party. Kindly step out, sir. Ooh, the seance, I get it now. Seance and sensibility. She's gonna be like, hey ladies, what's going on? Or whatever the like 18th century, is that what this is? I'm gonna totally embarrass myself, but she's, whatever version of Valley Girl is happening here is what's happening, it's gonna happen. Girls, I could say I share your sentiment. He's <laughs> coming to me now. And then the guy we pushed all your hook up with. <laughs> Oh my god, get your key. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, Zari. This is moving really fast. You do? Oh my god, she's gorgeous. Kill me. What's your name? Uh, <laughs> my name is Zari. What are you? Whoa, she's like, I just hooked up with a magical creature and I kind of liked it. Maybe it will work out with Charlie. Who knows? Or at least that's how it sounded in my head. Wow, her, did you see her eyes light up? Awesome. Yeah, she's into it. <laughs> Can Sarah please walk in on this? Oh. oh my God, I swear. Oh, I thought she was getting it in. I did not know. I'm going to sleep with a magical fugitive. Except for Charlie. I would follow Missouri to the world's end. So would I. Mood. I only sought to grant people the courage to follow their heart's desire. Oh, he likes you. Mm. Get Look at those two. We can go Historical records still indicate that Jane Austen's career is Oof. We, we love a gray tank top. <laughs> Oh God. <laughs> so cute. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, <laughs> um, okay. Oh, trope. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. That's a terrible outfit. <laughs> So wait a second, I have a question. Since the Kama Sutra guy is in their presence, are, is everyone gonna start getting real lusty? Is this happening? Is there gonna be a hookup? I beg for this shit. The thing is, I pride myself on being a gentleman and the gentleman thing to do would be to sleep in the chair. So. You're gonna sleep in that chair with your whole big ass body? You, there's no way you... Oh, <laughs> If you wouldn't mind leaving off your roles for a bit, joining us for that brief seance, and I'll have him on his way in. <laughs> if you're not busy at the moment, can we just do like a little seance? Nothing I can say, no. Okay. Oh, he's about to release some sexy dust into the world. I feel like I read, I did read Once Upon a Time, a Once Upon a Time fic of this for Emma and Regina. 
If you know, you know, that's all. I, I stan this so hard. <laughs> this is a Greek myth also, AKA Perseus. <laughs> oh. Did I do? What are we watching right now? What's happening? What is happening? Oh my god. It's so funny because they're married. Yes. Oh my god, consent we stand Ray. <laughs> oh stop. Stop this immediately. Wait, we're not gonna get to see it? <gasps> oh, please, no. <laughs> I'm sorry, we didn't get to see Ava and Sarah's sex dream? <laughs> She's thinking about sorry. <laughs> wow, this is super... Oh! <gasps> I can't. I am unable to can. Okay, oddly, I'm a little bit into it. Damn it this is definitely a dream. <laughs> <laughs> did it get to you too? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that's, I mean, sucks for you. Why did you? Kill the mood right now. Oh my gosh, she looks so good. Stop. And now for a break.